the Canadian, the partnership with Canada is important in multiple ways. First, uh, Canada has experience in some of the new emerging areas which India is looking at. Uh, for example, you know, green skills. Uh, second, uh, skills in the resources uh, areas of agriculture, uh, water, uh, where we are looking at specific uh, needs of the Indian economy given that the Prime Minister of India is focusing on cleaning the river Ganga or the Swachh Bharat Abhiyan or the toilet uh, program there and water is an important uh, resource. The second is that um, the Canadian uh, system is so well integrated with India. We have actually a lot of collaboration in the education space between um, Canada and India and we see that most graduates and people who come out of the education system in, in India are looking at getting a skill and what best uh, to look at the Canadian experience here which is uh, very well understood in, in terms of uh, the people of India. There is a, you know, a huge, there's actually 1.5 million, more than 1.5 million people from India in Canada so there are a lot of routes back home and that will enable this uh, cooperation between the two sides to actually grow much faster. And the third is that you know we are trying to bring in a new dimension to the Canada-India trade relationship and with the Make in India program and the opportunities that would be opened up with for Canada through the bilateral investment treaty, through the comprehensive economic partnership, as Canadian firms uh, go out to invest in India, they need people and what better to have people in India who have been trained and certified to Canadian standards and Indian standards as well. Uh, CI CAN and NSDC has been a very strong relationship and a lot of work has gone into what we see as these 13 MOUs that were signed today and exchanged in front of the Prime Minister between the Minister for International Trade and myself but uh, I think we kind of pursued each other across different continents. Uh, we did sign the earlier agreement uh, in, in the presence of Governor General in last February uh, that uh, Memorandum of Understanding was valid for one year so it is very uh, uh, opportune for us to actually extend this partnership at this point of time but the MOU is the first step and the tone and tenor of the MOU that we signed last February and the tone of tenor of the MOU that we signed this year might seem same but the action on the ground is significantly different and we look to you know a lot of people in CI can working and looking at India and working uh, from the NSDC point of view in actually getting these MOUs off the ground and very active so that the people in both countries benefit.